watching CBS 4 News. Now that school is back in session, don't be surprised if you uh, hear your kids humming some opera tunes. Oh, yes. Joyce is here to tell us some of Boston's best opera singers have been sharing their music with local students, and I understand that you're going to sing through your intro. <laughs> <laughs> no! Oh, not bad. I do not believe I did that. The Boston Lyric Opera is kicking off the company's 30th anniversary season by going into Boston schools, community centers, and churches talking about and singing opera. The week-long program has visited more than a dozen locations, and this morning, children at the Ellis Mendel School in Roxbury were treated to the talents of two of the Lyric Opera's biggest stars. <laughs> Soprano Lisa Dalterus and bass Morris Robinson have performed operas here in Boston and throughout the world. But they've never performed for an audience quite like the one they sang for at the Mendel School in Roxbury. The third, fourth, and fifth graders were mesmerized by the singers' voices and by their personal stories. I was actually, believe it or not, I was a soprano when I was your age, so <laughs> I sang really, really, really high. Ah! You know, and, and hiring them. But opera is not just for the aristocracy, it's not just for a certain group of people. And I think the more that they see people that look very much like themselves, who have similar backgrounds, who've come from the same type of situations, uh, the more accessible we make that art form to them. I, mean, I know that there was a particular person in my life, besides my mother, that, you know, this lit up for me, that just opened a whole new world of possibility for me. And uh, that's what I want to give back to the community. And the children even learned a little Italian today when their cheers turned to bravos. That is so cool. The Lyric Opera continues its 30th anniversary celebration with a Wang Center concert on Friday night.